would happen if Russia invaded Finland? Initially, the world's attention turns to Finland, assuming it will be an easy target. However, that's far from the truth. Let me explain. Finland is the homeland of Simo Heha, the deadly sniper who killed over 500 Russian soldiers in the Winter War of 1939 using just a basic sniping rifle. His legacy of resilience is a source of inspiration for the Finnish people. After 24 hours, the spirit of Sisu kicks in. Sisu is a Finnish term embodying extraordinary determination in the face of adversity. From city folks to farmers, everyone transforms into fearless warriors, ready to defend their homeland against any threat. One week later, Finland's dense forests and rugged terrain become a formidable obstacle for the invaders. The Finns, adept in guerrilla warfare and intimately familiar with their landscape, turn these natural features into their advantage. Two weeks in, international support for Finland surges, particularly from neighboring countries like Sweden and Norway. These nations, bound by historical ties and shared values, rush to support Finland. After one month, the situation escalates as Russia threatens to use nuclear weapons if Finland continues to receive international aid. Three months later, Russia faces significant losses, especially on land. The cost of the invasion, in terms of both human lives and resources, becomes increasingly untenable. The Russians are reminded of a harsh lesson. Attacking Finland is a significant miscalculation.